Nicole Snooky <laughs> Felizzi has found herself a new gig designing cabanas. I like that. She is joining us now. Nicole, you look beautiful, by the Hi. way. And, and How are you guys? You look great. You do look great. And are you speaking to us from uh, a massive closet? Oh, yeah. It's my, it's my closet. It's a little messy, but... This is actually, we built this house from scratch, and this is one thing that I wanted in my house was a big closet. So here you go. You're it's utilizing your, that space. Right? It's your Carrie Bradshaw <laughs> yeah. right there. It's Nic my interview place. <laughs> Nicole, how are the kids doing? What's the latest? The kids are good. Um, Lorenzo's eight now, Giovanna's six, and Angelo's one. He's going to be two soon. So my house is definitely chaotic, especially with, you know, oh, COVID and not going to school full time. It's just always a circus. Oh, I know. You know, our kids are like a very similar Same ages. age. So yeah, no, and so they're adorable. Yeah. I, lo I love all the names mm -hmm. too. By the way, what did the kids think when they saw you in that Super Bowl commercial? With the cartoons. Oh my God, they screamed. Giovanna asked if I knew Dora's um, Dora the Explorer's Instagram because she wanted to talk to her. So <laughs> she thinks I'm like friends with all these people now. Um, but it was so cool. Such a cool experience. Uh, your daughter's dance moves. Can we discuss? Her gymnastics, her dancing. She's so talented. Her cheering. Yeah. The spirit fingers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Giovanna. <laughs> oh, yeah. Our TikTok. So she actually <laughs> taught me how to do TikTok with like the timing and cutting it up. I had no idea what I was doing. And she's six. So she was teaching me how to do TikTok. <laughs> and she does competitive cheerleading right now. So she she's killing it. Her team keeps winning first place in the virtual competition. So I'm it. just so proud of her. She's amazing. Uh, I need to eat her up. Look at her, Mario. Hey, that's good. That's hard to do right there. Yeah, that's why she'd get yeah, along with Gia so well. <laughs> so funny. Um, we got to talk about this new show on uh, Discovery, streaming service Discovery. It's called Beach Cabana Royale. Mm -hmm. I love me a cabana. I love All a cabana. All I want to do on vacation is chill in a cabana. Right. Mm -hmm. So tell us about the, about the premise here. So I definitely, you know, want to do something different than reality all the time. So I wanted to try hosting a little bit. I've done hosting a little bit here and there, but um, the fact that it's on a beach, like the set, we were on a beach for like five days. It was so gorgeous, so cozy, and the designers were great. And um, yeah, they just had to turn out these like gross, like boring cabanas into like a real like, you know, like a Vegas pretty cabana, and they killed it. And they only had like three days to do it, but they were working from like 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. trying to turn everything out. So they they killed it. They did amazing. And I love hosting. I feel like I want to do some more. It's just different. I, I like how it's not always about me. Like I don't have to do everything. You know right. what I mean? Like I could just introduce it and then toss it to somebody else. And then I go and, you know, sip my latte. <laughs> you did great. I was watching it there. Talk about some of the cabanas. I saw a navy and white kind of a nautical theme. What are some themes that they went with? Um, so I feel like one theme was very Gatsby, which I loved because my wedding theme was Gatsby. So it was all like old school, very bold colors, which I love. And then there was like one like modern one and then like one just like regular plain one. Um, but if I were to make a cabana, it would be like leopard walls, <laughs> it would be cozy couches. I feel like there'd be like a little stunt bar for my daughter. I really would turn out one if I was a designer. When you go out in the Jersey Shore, like what, what is that like? You have to be stopped everywhere you go. Um, honestly, I don't leave my house yeah. <laughs> because we have such a nice backyard. My husband has a boat, so I, I hardly go on the boardwalk. We don't go to the beach just because we have such a nice backyard. Um, and we're on the boat constantly, like fishing and crabbing. The kids love it. So, yeah, I'm, I'm usually at home. I don't like going out just because... You know, I'm a homebody. Yeah. I love that, Nicole. Well, you've been there, done that. Yeah. So, you yeah, know, this is, this is a great next phase yeah, right I'm here. Yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. One last question. Uh, Nicole, I know you're, you're a huge Britney Spears fan. Did you see the new documentary? On Hulu? <gasps> oh, my God. So I just watched it last night, and I, I made sure to drink a glass of wine while watching it because I knew I was going to get upset. And, yeah, I'm upset. I feel really bad, and I just don't know what's going on. I feel awful for her. What upset you the most? I think the fact that she literally, well, from what, you know, we saw, it looks like she has no freedom and she, she just doesn't have any control over anything. And I just feel like she had a breakdown and people didn't see it and they just used it for publicity and making money off of her when she really just needed help and someone to talk to. So 
it was sad to watch because I love Brittany. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's well, we love you. Snooki, great to see you. We're really happy with your life and where you are and everything you're doing right now. So keep loving all yeah. those babies. Boy, are they cute. Congratulations, sweetie. Hopefully we'll see you in person soon. Yeah, thank you guys. Oh, so great. Beach Cabana Royale is streaming now on Discovery Plus.